62-year-old Nancy Nichols walks a mile a day in the halls of her Southwest Kansas apartment complex, something she never would have been able to do a year ago. I kept thinking, something's not right. In 2019, Nancy was suffering from shortness of breath and fainting spells. Her oxygen levels were dangerously low, but no one knew why. Nancy was placed on oxygen 24 hours a day, but her condition deteriorated. I was told I was having a stroke. And I thought, I'm not having a stroke. They didn't have an answer, and I wasn't satisfied. But I prayed to God every day that he would heal my lungs. It was a pulmonologist in Hutchinson, Kansas, who put Nancy on the path to healing when he referred her to the University of Kansas Health System. They sent my records. I had received a call from a pulmonologist, and she was the one that said, Nancy, you need to see a cardiologist right away. And I said, you're kidding. And she transferred my records to Dr. Hodge, and he was one that discovered the hole in my heart. She says almost immediately after Dr. George Hodge repaired it, she felt like a new woman and hasn't been on oxygen since. His wisdom and knowledge was what struck me. I was in complete awe of Dr. Hodge, and I thought I should have been to him years ago. Had anybody known it was my heart, Nancy says she believes God put Dr. Hodge in her life for a reason, and she's so grateful every day she gets to see her grandson go fishing or play soccer. When he makes a goal, he runs down the field with his arms in the air. She can take care of her mom now, and... Just recently, about a month ago, I was given an Angel Among Us certificate. She now ministers to female inmates at the local county jail. It's a bright future for me. I'm not in a nursing home. I'm not on oxygen. It's a great feeling. I haven't felt this good in three years.